What does the anointing mean to you? The anointing is the smearing. The Bible talks about the anointing being the smearing, the oil being poured out upon an individual. The anointing is the power of God. The anointing is a a, a special empowering that the Holy Spirit brings and gives to each and every believer. The Bible talks about the anointing that you received from the Lord abides with you. So that's because the anointing is the spirit of the living God. Jesus is the anointed one, right? So if Jesus is the anointed one and the spirit of God lives on the inside of you, then you have supernatural power. You have the anointing of Christ literally dwelling on the inside of you. Now, I believe that God gives us all unique individual anointings as well. So for instance, there is an anointing that you have on your life that someone else doesn't have. It's a specific anointing and it's specific to your calling, right? The power of the Holy Spirit wants to move in and through you freely so that you would even see the the calling of God. God wants to show himself through you. This world needs to see Christians that are on fire and are empowered by the spirit of the living God, not backing down, but knowing, listen, you bring all of heaven everywhere you go. When you have the mentality that you're an anointed vessel of the Lord God and that you carry resurrection power. So the anointing, which does mean the smearing, the applying of the oil, the from like an Aaron's beard, the oil was poured on the top of his head and it just went down, right? In other words, you're being drenched with a power of God. And the Bible talks about in Isaiah 10, 27, that the anointing will break the yoke. The yoke is oppression. The yokes are are our difficulties, oppressions that the enemy places upon you, but the anointing in your life will break every yoke as you realize you walk with Christ, you live with him. The spirit of the living God lives on the inside of you. So therefore you carry yoke breaking anointing that destroys the enemy's assignment, defies the enemy's schemes, and causes you to rise above it all because you're bringing the power of God to this situation that you're in today. Everywhere you go, walk in the understanding that the anointing of God is the power of God on your life. You are going somewhere to make something happen, bringing the kingdom of heaven everywhere you go. Go forth and change atmospheres simply because you walk in God's divine anointing.